Welcome back to Garden Ninja, and today I'm at Hampton Court Flower Show exhibiting my plant explorer design for Hartley Tanks. And I wanted to show you this, the Alpine House, and this time I've used a whole range of succulents for the display. Now I know that the Earth Plants and Succulents Facebook page might be interested in how I've arranged them, so come on in and I'll give you a quick look around. So the first specimen I want to show you, because it's a real winner, is this, the Echeveria Blueprints. And it's got these milky blue coloured leaves here. It's in flower with kind of a peachy nectarine coloured flower that really sets up against the blue. It's a real winner for me. We've then got this Euphorbia iGens, which is kind of the atypical cartoon looking cactus, which I think is just brilliant the way it plays off against the succulents. We've got Semper Vivums, which I've recently done a number of videos on showing you how to arrange. And what I've done in this glass house is use mess tins, because we're linking back to the plant explorers that went out a couple of hundred years ago and sought all these rare species, which we now take for granted. So I've arranged the Semper Vivums and mess tins with other sedums and succulents to give a real interesting look to the glass house. Over here in the corner, we've got a kind of hyped up version of the Semper Vivum container guide, which I showed you a few weeks back. And again, I've used sedums, such as sedum Coca-Cola, which has a kind of blue and red tinge to it, and a load of other specimens that sort of droop and hang over the edge to give some real texture. So that's just a snapshot of the Alpine Glass House here at Hampton Court 2018. If you've liked this video, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel for more garden design hints, tips and hacks. I've been Garden Ninja, happy gardening.